Well, I see the pit has become a rather nice place to work. Got all of our smoothing done. Hey folks, this is Noble Rambler, and welcome back to RimWorld, and Michael's uh, project of block cutting here. Yeah, probably best to make them go put them away now. I was thinking we could just continue to drop them, but... Hmm. Yeah, that may be the best way it is to maintain this. Anyway, so, nice place to cut blocks. Not as big of a... Of a, of a detriment to their moods now let's put it that way and who was that just ran by that was rabbit he is planting all the pots for the rooms that aren't quite being used yet but gives him something to do that he likes because he is what green thumb green thumb which means every time he plants something he gets a bonus so it's six plants so far today Woohoo! now where's everybody i cornered Tomislav and got him to do some smoothing over here. So he's going to get this first room up and going. Kind of want to look at this too. And he's still sound asleep. Worked her way into the night. Got uh, her to actually finish off this room here. So we got that one done. We got all the blocks laid out into here except for a few more and Gecko, who's soon to be renamed, is uh, bringing the last few over there. Let's continue our tour here. Rabbit is going to sow some more hay grass. And, oh, these must really have a timer to them. They do. Look at that. Oh, will you quit moving? <laughs> Starts expiring in 0.3 hours. Finishes expiring in 12 hours. So, yeah, it's an accumulative thing. It stacks and, and it's got a short uh, time span. Okay. Um, Chantigo is working on relaxing socially. He's just about out of meat again. Oh, and we're out of this. So, Shantigo, when you're done, relax and come on up and refuel this. But, yeah, meat is always going to be a problem as we get into larger quantities of, of uh, colonists and prisoners. They're eating a lot of them, too. We have two Ibex over here. We've got a wolf. I've got a turkey right there. Two turkeys. We've got a wolf in here somewhere right there. And I saw a lynx. There's a lynx right over there. And there's an emu. Yeah, I think we need to do a quick group hunt and get some more meat coming in. Klaus is <clears throat> relaxing socially. And then let's pause here. Let's go ahead and grab the group and go do that, that hunt real quick before Klaus gets back into uh, um, into recruiting. But Sangria, hauling steel, I asked her to do... Where are you at? You're over here. There you are. So I asked you to fill in some of the blanks. In some of the spots that were left, like that concrete floor right there, just to kind of fill them all in, then Handy will get the order to go and install everything. I had uh, Natalia, who just finished that, who's going to rest now, needs. Ah, it didn't work you too hard. I got you to the end um, to fill in all of the steel for this turret bay over here. Actually, it's right there, and yeah, just like this one, and or what do you call it? We'll call it a turret foxhole. Yeah, that'll work right over here and then all the conduits in the area including the conduits go out into here so once handy gets free which is not very often i usually got her pinned in, into a whole series of chores but uh when she breaks free she'll come in and just zip all this together and we'll have our power up and going um so we got as far as sangria i believe Kathra is relaxing socially going to bed michael's cloud watching though you needed a meal no you got one okay and Miss Peep is playing horseshoes. So everybody hit that 10 o'clock hour and they're, they've just kind of thrown away everything I had them doing. Yeah, well, digging at marble. I did ask Alicia to come into the kitchen area. Let's go ahead and take out the last of these original stone walls and go ahead and put in... Uh, uh, oh, you did this one already. Or no, it's... Here, there it is. Uh, put in the, the uh, constructed walls. So build, copy. There is one there. There is not. There is now. And you're going to there. Okay, then we're going to do this area too. But you are where now? Alicia is going to this one next. Okay. So, who, what, how? Hmm. This might be a good time to train some of them to... Oh, Gecko. I stopped one. I've got to get used to being a 12th one. Gecko, you're over here. You are meditating. Um, While you're meditating, he got really, really low in his mood. So, and he, his bars were all pretty good. I guess there's a lot of 
stuff that was just kind of left over from being in the jail. Maybe that's it. Um, although Catherine did stop by and, and uh, land him a really nice insult <laughs> a little while ago. Anyway, let's name Gecko before we go out and do a quick hunt. Gecko, you are, while well, you're meditating, you meditate on your new name. You are Eric. Got Eric back in. Eric was with us for Alpha 13. And uh, get him back into the series. And, you know, we've only had Eric and Michael. Yep, from the original group. That's the only two guys we've been able to recruit so far in 75 episodes. Wow. Yeah. So we've, we've definitely got to get more guys in here. The, the list for guys is long. So hopefully we can continue working on that. Um, so Eric is a... I wonder, does it... It does automatically put the name in without having to wait for the game to reset. Okay. So Eric was a plague prodigy. Eric's childhood was cut short when a mysterious plague hit his home world. He watched his friends die, and his compassion for humanity died with them. In its place, a new thirst for knowledge emerged. So, social negative two, construction plus two, and intellectual plus four. Cannot do doctoring or art. And as an adult, he's become a mad scientist who likes to build things. Eric's lust for knowledge was only matched by his disdain for anyone who would stand in the way of his research. I guess that'll be me, because I'm going to have him cleaning, or smoothing floors. <laughs> Traveling from world to world, he sought answers to questions few dared to ask. Gave him a plus seven in intellectual, and gave him plus three in construction. Okay, research maybe, as well as creating the things he's researching. Okay, so there's the construction, and then negative two social. So, what else about Eric? A psychopath, has no empathy. The suffering of others doesn't bother him at all. He doesn't mind if others are butchered, left unburied, imprisoned, or sold. So, butchered or left unburied or imprisoned. So, he's capable of hauling bodies just like, say, Natalia would be, except she doesn't haul. So I think Eric could be a helper for Alicia for getting the, uh, the dead out of the gauntlet uh, or sold into slavery unless it affects him personally. He also feels no mood boost from socializing. Steadfast. There's a bonus. Um, Eric is mentally tough. Interesting. And won't break down under stress that would crack most people. Back to needs. That did feel like it was kind of low. Where's Klaus? How does that? How do these three lines compare? The same. So Klaus wants to have steadfast. As, no, he's got iron willed. Okay. Um, but Klaus, these lines are further down the to the left than others. Like Shantigo, it kicks it up over here. Go back to Klaus down over there, and then over to Eric, same place. Okay. So Klaus and Eric will have the same bonus of. Of being able to go further down the line. So he must have been really down the line because he was right here last night in the dark trying to build that marble wall out there in the, the uh, Boomalope pasture. So, yeah, he'll he'll level off here in a while when things start to get back to normal. And when we start get getting um, more impressive things like impressive dining room and impressive rec hall. Impressive dining room is there. Curious, I was going to combine the dining room with the rec hall. Let me know if that's a mistake, meaning the game now designates rooms to specific purposes. And if we have a dining table here and a pool table in here, will that confuse things and give us only a impressive dining room or only an impressive rec room? Do we, I don't want to split that. Hmm. We could kick this in a couple more. Put the walls out over here somewhere and make this a little bit bigger and then split it if we had to i'd rather not and it may not count for anything unless i put a door on there let me know what you think about that too we'll see we'll, we'll load it up and we'll see what 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 it turns into but to finish eric real quick who i've now got to get out of the habit of thinking of as gecko uh character and misogynist so really dislikes and distrusts women hmm We'll see if if Andy's 
beauty, beautiful or beauty will over overwhelm that. Well, we'll see how that how they interact with their with their. Um, let's see, handy actually, Eric, and social. Yeah. So, is there a handy in there? Right there. So plus ten so far, but he hasn't had a lot of interaction with a lot of people yet. Um, hostile to rival Schmidt. Oh, we have a rival built in. So Schmidt is already going to be... Eric is hostile, but not from the other end. Okay, so Schmidt already likes Eric, plus 77. Hmm. Um, from the saws? Ah, from the saws. Versus from the... Uh, who are the other ones? Oyster from Accorda Munio. Because factions, the saws, are a pirate band who are the enemies of the Court of Mino. Right there. Okay, it's all starting to roll together, but let's, get, let's grab a quick um, hunting party. Tomislav's down here. He's just finishing up. Okay, that works. Where to first? Take out the wolf first, or take out... Let's go this area first. Let's head up in here. Head up into this area for me. Tomislav... And Handy's still asleep. I really like her assault rifle. Needs, but you need to get a meal. Uh, well, Tomislav is. Wait, did I do that right? Tomislav, I didn't. He's going to skip the last of the, of that. Hmm. Let's take a little bit. So Tomislav, oh, I can't. I can't see come there later because I have to draft. Okay, never mind. So Handy, you're going to grab a meal, and then you're, well, draft, grab a meal. And then you're heading out into this area as well. We'll just kind of disturb everybody's day for a little bit. Um, come on over and do this to Shantigo. There's not much meat left, so you may as well just come on out and have some fun over here. Klaus, you were relaxing socially. You don't really need it. You come on up here too. We'll just get the whole gang up here. Yeah, that'll be fun. Um, draft, come on up. Catherine, if we do it in mass numbers, the hunt is over in just an hour or two, and they can all spend the rest of the day doing all the things that they need to do. That is Catherine. You come out here as well. Natalia, rest. I think you can pull this off. Yeah, you come join us. You got plenty of food, and, and your mood? Ah, oh, your mood's already gone bad. Now nah, you go back and rest. Okay, that's not going to work. Okay. Michael. Right there, everything's fine. You up here as well. Miss a P. Rest. Mood is heading down low and hard. But Joy is kind of on its... Actually, it's not. Why is that? You'd think playing horseshoes, the Joy would be rising, but we're... Hmm. But let's grab a meal and come on up. You and Handy can make the run together. So you grab the other one of these meals. Okay. Oh, you're already grabbing a meal. Okay, well, let's draft you. Grab that one. Yeah, that works. And then come on up into... I lost it right there. Okay, who's left? Alicia. Digging at... Yeah, you're fine. Draft, come on up into... Over here. And i got to stop double-clicking. And Eric, you... Hmm. What do we do with Eric? He's got a shield belt, so we can't shoot. So, Eric, I'm going to pass this time. You let me know. Do you want to concentrate on melee? Which is really difficult to get you. I mean, you kind of just use you to finish folks off when... Now, that's not even easy, either. When we're down to the last of the, you know, the enemies and they're breaking, we need to subdue them. But you're going to be... If you're going to be melee you're going to be skilled at it and you're going to have the best melee weapon we've got and you're going to end up cutting people's heads off so we're not going to gain many prisoners with you being melee either melee either so i'm thinking i want to tell you what let's just do that and you can let me know in the comments if you have a another preference but let's get you onto land right there let's shed the belt uh shield belt drop let's Thumbs down to rabbit, or vice versa. Uh, slided rabbit. 
<laughs> okay. You're not uh, um, abrasive, but you're not too thrilled with rabbit there. And um, I need you to pick up a weapon on your way out. What is that going to be? For now, let's get you into something like a uh, charge rifle. So, draft, come, charge, uh, equip, and then meet us out over here. Right there. Okay, so I think that is everybody on their way. Now, if I were to do something like that, that everybody's highlighted. Okay, we've got everyone's path in there. Catherine's going that way. <clears throat> Have a couple should be eating dinner right now. Where am I at? Right over here. I'm not seeing that. Miss P, where'd you go? That somehow didn't work. Didn't work. Interesting. Let's try that again. Consume a meal. And then... Head up. Actually, by the time you get here, we'll already have done some of this. So then head up to here. Yep. Cued. Moving. Fine meal. So, handy. Same thing. It didn't work for you either. I held the shift down. At least I thought I did. Why don't you? Maybe it's the same pile. Maybe it interacts a little differently drafted than when not. And they I would send them both to the same pile. So maybe somehow they conflicted. So in that case, why don't you come over and consume meal. Where are you at, by the way? You made it that far. Okay. But you're going to need it. And then you head out over here as well. So that is queued. Okay, that's working. It was only the only two that needed... There's a rat. That needed... Uh, to eat. Shantigo's already here. Must went up in this area doing something. There's Eric and Rabbit and Sangria and Meadow <laughs> and a pig on a mission. I don't know, that's Alicia. Wait a minute. Where'd the pig go? That was in there, right there. On a mission. Must have dropped something off there. Okay. There's Divot doing the same thing. Oh, you guys are probably all bringing steel in. I had the steel being brought over to do all of this. Okay. Now there was a ding. Whoa. Okay. So Cathra is. Hmm. Just got under and she's heading down so low because of the prisoner. Ugly environment. Okay. Feeling terrible. Decent barracks and a little pain. Hmm. Now hopefully that calms down a bit. Who was the third? Natalia's asleep. Miss a P. Needed food, and that's going to be taken care of here. Okay, so here's the first of the group there. The others, handy. Miss Pete, you guys have eaten, and you're heading up here to meet us. Okay. That's there. So this group here. All right, so you guys, what's the plan? Head over to here. We got nine here. That's a good group. It stacks well. A lot of steel still. Good. Got lots of turtles. Okay, well, while we're waiting, let's double click on... Oh, just the two. Hmm. All right, you guys, let's take out this one. That, yeah, that worked. Kind of. Okay, let's move a little closer. Oh, got him. Okay. And one more time. Okay, those two are done. Let's go ahead and unforbid them. There were a couple other... There were turkeys up in here. We'll save all the little stuff. Mostly just want to go after the stuff that... That is a danger to a hunter. So maybe we'll leave the turkeys. Though there was that turkey revenge one time. <laughs> I was really surprised to see that. But yeah, we should probably set somebody up as a hunter. Handy hop in there as well. And let's go after the wolf and the lynx. And that might be it for this run. These two over here. Okay, Miss B, where'd you ever land? There you are. You hop in here too. And then actually all of you, come on out to... Where to? Wolf is there. How best? Go to here for now. Let's do that again. Four deep there, four deep there. We'll go with four deep and we'll move the front one to the back somewhere. 
Actually, let's go to here and do that. We'll see if the wolf moves into a line of sight. Yeah, I think that's going to get... Well, boy. Now, let's, let's head over here then. See if we can't... I want as much distance between us as we can. And now the wolf's going this way. <laughs> I'm going to have to flush him out. Here we... No, he stopped again. All right, so Alicia, I need you to... Like, there. There we go. Now, can you guys all send a hail of bullets? You can't. All right, let's break and do that. And let's attack. There. Two people can. Nobody can. <laughs> all right, that's not going to work. You guys all move back over there. One person's going to have to go in. Well, now you're... Okay, well, stop. And Alicia, you go there. And everybody else... Um, attack. And Alicia, you go to here. There we go. Now everybody... Nope. Attack. And as we get closer... Why do you keep doing that to me? There. I think that's everybody now. Come on, guys. There you go. Unforbid you. Let's go take care of the lynx and the emu. There we go. There's, there's, a, there's a few of those on the map. So pop over here. There's a good group hunting foe. Any, any ostriches we find, too. Major break risk is whom now? Um, Miss P. So Miss P, through all of this, you're right there. Needs. Yeah, you're crashing. Okay, well, let's... Oh, night owl in the daytime. I can't get you to eat. I've just got to try to get you back there. Hopefully, you make it. Removing hyperweave toque. Here? <laughs> okay. That makes you happy. Was there a reason for that, Needs? That didn't help any. Hmm. No. Wasn't worn out apparel or something like that. I don't know. Well, we'll see if we get a pop-up message about Miss P. You know, wandering around in a daze or something. Let's go a little tiny bit closer. Right in there. And Shantigo, step uh, back to there. And say hello. A lot of bullets to hit before anybody made contact. Okay, you're done. You guys, come on down to. Did we ever get to the links? We talked about it. Where'd he go? There he is. Right in there. Four in the afternoon already? No way. Okay, so who here is in trouble otherwise? Shantigo? What is with Shantigo? I need to send somebody home. Who is that going to be? Needs? You're going to be needing a meal soon. Otherwise, folks are just not all that happy right now, are they? They're really not. We're really touching moods on a lot of folks. Shantigo, let's send you back. Hunt. You can... Hunt the lynx and bring him back. And, oops. There we go. And the rest of us, was there anything else? Seems like there is one more emu or ostrich somewhere. Or is that just a release on everyone to go and do whatever it takes not to, you know, to break and go crazy? We're fine there. As we get further into spring, we should see larger herds start to show up again. But, you know, I think we're done. Anything to show up down here? No. Okay, then you guys are all released. And go ahead and do whatever you need to do. Got him. All right. Do what you need to do. Let's go back to Miss P. How's she doing? Really dangerous area there. Yeah, she should have been. I didn't I had no idea it was that late. Time goes by way too fast for me in this game. 
I was thinking two, three hours up there at the most, and wasn't it like 10 or 11 in the morning when that happened? So, you know, done by noon or so, but I guess not. Okay, you're going to drop off. Hopefully you're going to head straight to resting. You know, you, you're, you're about to go insane on me here, but you got to get that helmet on. Okay, well, if that makes you feel better. Okay. And it did. So, somehow, that got you back over the line. Weird. <laughs> and now you're going up even more. Why? What happened? Nothing is increasing here. Um, I don't know. And how is this a slightly impressive dining room? So, Shantigo, are you back to being kind of happy? You want to consume a fine meal. You do that. Let's get somebody else to reload. Now oh, you're in trouble too. You're in trouble. Uh, Catherine, where are you going? You are cutting stone. Let's have you instead work on that. That will increase your happiness. Michael, you are still kind of iffy as well. Who's not going to die on me here that can bring some wood over? So you need, you need food and you're doing that. Um, rabbit's in great shape. Where is he? He's harvesting hay grass. I better leave him alone. Handy, you are playing horseshoes where? Right over in there, and your joy is tanked big time. And Tomislav is needing a meal. But you're researching. Interesting. You, 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 you win. You get to, uh, you get to do this. And then, by the time you get over here, you'll grab a meal. Okay, you do that for Sean Diego. Get him up and going again. Make him start cooking, because he really likes to cook. And I could have had all these folks bring these in. Did, I didn't think about that. Yeah, I could have. Hmm. Well, somebody's going to get the chore of butchering. And that, in this case, means walking long distances to go get something to butcher. Yeah. There are a couple of pigs we could have gotten. Wow. Did these just arrive? I think they just arrived. You correct me if I'm wrong, but I didn't see that many. I saw the turtles. I didn't see that many pigs. Hmm. And their run speed is what? Can Handy do this? Five. Ah, uh, kind of. I think we could kind of get her into a safe place in time, but... I don't know. Anyway, down to five. And who's missing out of that? Not sure who was there that I can't think of now. But of the rest of them, that needs to go away and be put away. 80%. We're at 78% now. Um, Tomislav is eating. Something just bounced over here. Yeah, I got a lot of stuff open. And we are really low on meals again. So I need somebody. Somebody is butchering. Shantigo is butchering. Okay, you can do that. And now you've got your stove back. And now life will be good again. So, Handy, you are playing horseshoe still. Food, don't really need it. Let's do what with you? Actually, when you're done with that, how about you hop up here and give me a turret? Right there? Yeah. Why don't you do that? Oh, let's do that instead. Turret, yeah. Because you've already got the command to head over here. Alicia, you are... You drew the short straw, didn't you? You're butchering. What's that doing to you? You're in good shape. All right, you... No, nothing to worry about there. So, Michael, you're in great shape again. We're down to only three who have problems. Um, Miss P is one, but her sleep will take care of that. Eric is on his way down. Where are you at? You're over here. You are assisting with this area as well. Okay. Um, what's it take? Your joy's going up because you like construction, so that's helping. What's it going to take to keep you from dropping? Can't really fix the beauty out here. And you don't really gain anything from having a nice talk with Handy. Um, otherwise, drop even further. Uh, 2100, you're going to go to bed soon in a superior bed, which is going to bring your comfort up. So that's going to help out here real soon. In fact, you already just got the command. There you go. Um, Handy, where are you? You got the command to... You can go a little bit further. Did you get that built? Let's go back and do that again. Let's see if we can't get that one in place for the night just in case 
something surprises us. I hope not. We have a lot of people on the edge. I want them to get some sleep. Okay, where did you go, by the way? Handy, right there. You're grabbing more steel. We were only short by six. Really? <laughs> yeah, yeah, and then three components. Hmm, you probably won't get the command to go back and do the components. Tell you what. Oh, we got power? No. We're gonna have power soon. Got a little leg over here to finish. Okay. I'll wait for Handy to get the six put in there. Where did you end up? Handy. There you are. You went the long way around. We'll get the components in, then you can go to bed. Then it'll be ready to, uh, to beckon someone tomorrow just to walk up and automatically work on it. Otherwise, let's get this one set to open so that just the power door is being used in here. I think that's the best way. Sangria also got the order to go butcher. Good. That means there'll be lots of meat for Tomislav tomorrow, or for Shantiko tomorrow, to get lots of meals put in, because we're down to 11. That's not good. And 10 of them are probably in the prison. Oh, none are in the prison. No, seven. Ugg was hiding them. Okay. All right, so butchering going on, meat being made. Handy's going to finish the job. Handy needs, she needs a meal. Let's make sure she does that before she goes to bed. There, she's already got it. Good. That's fine. And that is it. Kathra needs really low and clear that. Go grab your own meal. That will hopefully fix you in time. Wild boar is pregnant. Sangria is ready to head to bed. Kathra, Natalia, what are you up to? You are looking back to normal over here. Bugsy is pregnant. Mm-hmm. Bugsy. Right over there. Okay. So lots of more puppies coming. And how was I saying? Natalia. So you've got your mood back. You're in good shape over here. And working on a duster? Duster. 228 left. And that's the end of this for a while, right? Bills? Yeah, 9 out of 10. Which doesn't mean much. We have a lot of worn out dusters we need to sell. So, what to do with you through the night? What will you drop into automatically? Natalia, tailoring. Once your tailoring is done, you drop into cooking. So you'll be butchering the rest of the night. Let's take that down one. Let's get more of things like what's left over here in the machining table. First one, disassemble mechanoids. Next one, make an armor vest. Two armor vests. Eric, I'm guessing, Eric came with one, didn't he? Character, uh, gear, he came with one. So that he still got the cloth parka on. We're probably waiting for this duster to be made here. No, there's dusters there. Uh, normal condition, full hit points. We're, yeah, so that's, he's just choosing. I probably never reset this. A sign. I started to last time. Anything. Then I had to decide whether or not we're going to ranged or not. So I'm going to range, but Eric, if you want to play a different kind of character, you let me know. And we'll adjust you back to a melee character. But I'm thinking that a ranged character would be the, the way to be able to join in a lot more. Unless you've got some tactics to share with me on how best to use a melee character. But to me, a, a melee character is just the one that's going to have to be rescued. <laughs> by. Or, we'll, we'll test the wild pigs on you when the first you know, group you go after takes you down. we got to go out there and try to get you back to a hospital bed. So I'm a little spooked on melee characters. And in Alpha 13, I never really made good use of them, so they kind of missed out on all the fun. Um, Miss B, what are you up to right now? You want to wear a better helmet than you've got, I'm guessing. Gear, you've got a poor 87% steel advanced helmet, and you are swapping that out for this one that showed up way over here so that you can get on a superior 84% helmet. Mm hmm good stuff. Then you are consuming a fine meal, and then you're going to head over here and work on these after the meal. So we can get that done and get those walls laid in. Then I need to get someone to bring over some blocks. 
which Natalia, your duster, where are you at now on it? 120 left, so let's probably get your last project before you go to bed. Okay, who's up? Usually uh, Thomas loves up early, Shantigo's up early. He's grabbing a meal, then he's gonna most likely get to work in here. So Shantigo, you're next going to reserve by Miss a P. Oh, she's gotta grab a meal first. Okay, now you're going to pull that away. You're gonna haul these away. And you take him over there to the prisoners. Okay, that works. Then you're going to put in, what are you? Lynx, bird, wolf. Let's see what the wolf is like. Oh, Shantigo. Send that one into your storage. Where are you going now? You are taking a simple meal. Okay. So you're going to put this over there. I'd like to get the corn out of here if I can. How do I do that? That's the last of the corn in here. Divot is dropping off more corn. Okay, I'm not going to fight it. <laughs> we have all these other things. Let's get, you know, potatoes and strawberries and rice over here. But, rabbit, you are sewing area. Good. And Tomislav researching after he finishes eating his breakfast. Eric is constructing. I had Catherine haul a bunch of blocks down in here. So Eric is going to kind of finish this area off. Um, hmm. What can I have you do that isn't critical down here? Actually, smoothing, but, hmm. You're just kind of working on things. Yeah. I, well, I asked Kathra to bring all the tiles over for this whole room. I set her up in four different places. That may have been when I hauled them all off to do the hunt. That could be it. But, Eric, I'm thinking that we really need this built. So it's probably best. Your food is fine. Let's have you pop out and get started on this one. And just work your way through all of that. Um, research. We're working on electric smelting to get to cremation. Just thought, started thinking about something else. I think we're going to toss out the refinery, which makes chem fuel, and get the the smelter and the incinerator or crematorium both those into here instead i think that may be the better route to go we could then put a stockpile over here or dumping pile of the slag pieces and that way that the the uh pop into that again the smelter will melt the slag into steel for us there um yeah so when that happens we'll do that Otherwise, I would like to get some smoothing done, but Handy, you are building things that the others can build. Let's get you back into working on some specialty stuff. Things that have to have high quality. Got this group done of nightstands and beds, and the only other thing I counted was chairs. And I'm thinking hospital beds. What if we go ahead and get these first three done? I don't think that the the Vados monitor has an issue with um, well it might you know, it doesn't change beauty or anything like that if it's shoddy versus superior but it may change the effect that it has on the hospital beds so let's have handy work on this one and let's do every other this one and this one and in the process, she may bring parts over for the other two or three things near them. Okay, let's get half of the of the, the surgery up and running. And then we're starting to get some medicine stocked over here. I set up a, a, a storage bay over here for the blue medicine so that Natalia who was make, and Catherine were both making uh, the medicine. They wouldn't have to drop it off all the way over here to do it. This all leaves before too long. Did we ever get a bedroom? We got a bedroom mostly done. Struck compact machinery. Okay, well that will eventually all be dug out anyway. So Miss P has chosen to work down over here and we got into steel. What a shame. We can dig this, but if we open up into something we don't want, we can't seal it back up again without sealing it in over here. Hmm. And you quit? Viewing art. Do you really need to view art? You kind of need to view art. Okay, I'll leave you alone. 
Which art you going to, by the way? Is it a really good art? That's a pretty good art. That's a beauty of 100. Your beauty up two. The game just dropped out on me again. It did the same time that it did last time, about 41 minutes into it. That's really weird. What could cause RimWorld 41 minutes into a session? You know, let's see, that time was like 8 in the evening. Right now it's almost 2 in the afternoon, so it's got nothing to do with the computer doing anything at, you know, at a certain time each day. That is really odd. And I've watched the uh, the memory. I've watched the you know of of the system. That's there's still eight gigabytes left. There's, and I'm not maxing anything out. I don't know what to do with that problem, other than just have to deal with splicing episodes or video segments together each time. That's really strange. Breakdown of an auto door. Let's jump over there, and yeah, that's that'll be fine. That'll be taken care of. So. Andy, you are doing what right now? You're playing horseshoes, okay? You don't really need to. Let's get you back into your... Whoa. She's quick. Let's get back into there. Well, there. There. And... There. Okay. Boomalope is pregnant. Okay. Um, Let's pop into animals while we're watching Handy do her, her magic down there. So will this tell me anything? It will. So 9 days out of 23 days. So we've got Sienna is 2 weeks out of a little over 3 weeks on hers. So is anybody get close to close to popping? <laughs> what is that? Breakdown battery. Now we've got all the breakdowns that we didn't get through all the rest of the series. And one more. And Eric. Oh, research. Electric, not Eric. Capital R and capital E just formed Eric in my brain. That's that's odd. Research screen. Let's pop you into electric cremation and research. Good. And Handy was over here. Don't know where she's off to. Eric is repairing the that one. And it's boop, back up and running. And Tomislav got the order to do something else. He is going to replace a broken component of battery. This got turned on, and we are doing some serious draining. We are. Okay. Through the night. It is 50 degrees outdoors right now. Do we open this roof up and turn these lights off? I turned this on so I can start charging this, but it's not doing it. Let's go ahead and flick these switches for another couple of days. Turn them all back on again. And just... There we go. Get everything a full charge again. It is 1400 hours to 2 p.m. And we'll see how much we can dump into these batteries by then. Probably by the end of tomorrow, game day, we'll have eight maxed out batteries and we can turn this off again. Set the other batteries in. Need to set more conduit in to get power entering all three, switching out of all three, and then coming down a main, which then feeds the rest of the place and we can choose which bank we want to be using and we did get these mined out so I need to get uh, the batteries built over here let's set these guys to haul and so we'll get four per bank over here just like over here and that's all protected and should still be considered roofed um, rock roof thin all the way across there yeah and over here Rock roof and constructed roof. Okay, that works. Anyway, this episode has got to turn off soon. Handy, you were and are. Okay, we've got something here. So, a vitals monitor. What can we learn about this? Um, medical 10 quality offset plus 7%. Inactive. Because it's not connected to a bed or because there's nobody in it. Let's see if that changes here. That bed is in. Offset. Well, inactive went away, so it has to be touching a bed to work. Now, next question is, if it if one touches two beds, we'll see how that works. I'm hoping that two monitors can do three beds. It seems logical. Uh, surgery success chance factor plus 10%. Immunity gain speed factor plus 2%. Anything else we can learn? Um, 
pretty sure we've read all of this when we were putting them in, but increases medical tan quality, surgery success chance, and immunity gain speed when placed directly adjacent to a hospital bed. Only works for hospital beds. Normal beds will not benefit. Attaching more than one vital monitor to the same bed will have no effect. But it doesn't say you can't attach more than one bed to a hospital monitor. It just says it the other. Everything here is fine. All right, that is that. We've got a superior hospital bed and a superior hospital bed. That's good stuff. So we're on our way. Catherine's making more medicine to replace what we just put in here. And life is good. So I think we're going to call it done here. It's been Noble Rambler. Thanks for watching, guys, and catch you later. Bye-bye.